Hey guys, Aaron from ADH Gaming here. I'm back checking out another Super Mario Maker mod. Now today's mod is actually based on a Super Nintendo ROM hack. You may have played it before or heard of it at least. It's called Super Mario World Piranha Island. So this mod is actually based on that. If you want to check this mod out for yourself, as usual, check down below in the video description. I put full credits as well as a link back to the mod itself. I had quite a lot of fun with this mod so I've decided to dedicate the next few episodes for it. Uh, what's been changed then? So we've got new tile sets, new backgrounds as you can see, new sprites and also the music's been changed around as well. As I'm sure you've already noticed this mod uses the Super Mario World theme here. So like usual I'm going to build up a small level, well I, I say it's going to be small, it probably turned out a bit bigger than what I thought. Uh, but yeah we'll see how we get on here. So the new tiles uh, for the ground, they're looking really good here, really sort of creates this creepy mood for this level so let's just build over to the right hand side here so the vines have been replaced so we get these uh, which really fit this theme let's put a platform up top here so yeah nothing too major but yeah i'm gonna hide some stuff up top the coopers uh you can give them invisible wings and it creates this really strange effect that i'm sure you're gonna see soon uh, so let's use some of those semi-solid platforms which, yeah, give off a really nice background effect. So we've got tree trunks and the platform there. A few coins up top. Let's build a few platforms over to the right just to get across this area. Let's continue on building up here. So yeah, the Wiggler, that's been changed. Kind of a darker, creepy version along with the spiny as well. Put a few coins there put a block down there with a fire flower well it's still a fire flower it just has a blue look to it especially when you fire it as well anyway i'm just going to finish this section off go and put a few coins down onto those moving platforms let's go down into the pipe so we're into the underground now and it's kind of like this volcano theme well at least i think it looks like that anyway so all of the ground tiles they've got all these cracks on definitely giving off that look Let's just put a bridge there, put a few of the lava bubbles across here as well. They've been changed to blue, bit of a colour upgrade. And the platforms, the mushroom platforms, have, they, they've had a slight colour change here. I'm not going to focus too much on them. Uh, yeah, the clouds, we've got a bit of a change there as well. And yeah, the semi-solid platforms, just going to try and use all of them here. As you can see, they definitely uh, look quite good for this thing. So we got Hammer Brothers over on the left there. Let's put one of the Magi Coopers down. They've definitely had an upgrade, so they kind of have this green colour to them. Let's put the PAL block over here somewhere, I think. Pop it up on top of the platform. So you get over to the Magi Coopers, and yeah, you should be able to destroy those. Now the blue Magi Cooper that I've just put down with the key, that actually takes over from Bowser, or Bowser Jr. I should say. Uh, so yeah, you need to defeat him, grab the key, and then we can get through one of these locked doors here. Let's just rearrange them slightly a bit. Put the key door up top with another platform around it, I think. And then, yeah, going into that pipe is going to take us back up. Uh, and as you can see, the theme for this one, the pipe is slightly different colour. Kind of like a, a yellow-orange look. So we're back up top, so let's put the pipe on the other side of the wall here. And we're finishing off here, so a few clouds with maybe a platform right up here. And then the goalpost can just be over on the right hand side. Perfect. Yeah, just give it a bit of an extra platform there. So yeah, quite a lot of stuff has been changed with this mod. Uh, which, some of it I will focus in future videos. Uh, maybe going a bit more into detail with it as well. Let's just put a few extra coins up top there. I think that's looking pretty good. Let's give it a go then. I really must say though, I love the graphic changes on this. I know it is based on a ROM hack and that had all original graphics. But it's quite nice to play a Mario mod that doesn't rely on, you know, having graphics from another game or anything. So I just wanted to uh, throw that out there. Let's grab some of those items, some of the coins. Perfect. So there's our invisible winged Coopers. Uh, yeah, definitely strange seeing that. Let's jump across the platforms, grab some coins. Definitely gives off this Luigi Mansion vibe to me. Especially as you do play as Luigi in this mod as well. Let's grab the Fire Flower. 
and there was a hidden one up there I put in as well. So we're down into the volcano area now. Some of those blue coopers. Let's head across the bridge where the lava bubbles are. Grab a few of those coins while I'm at it. So yeah, I need to go and get that power block up top. Let's take out the Hammer Brothers first. So yeah, I can just throw that at the Magi Coopers down there. Perfect. Didn't really want to do that. And there's our boss fight. So yeah, the Magi Coopers overtaking Baby Bowser. Kind of turns into this strange little piranha plant. I kind of like that. What's that? Two times? Just one more to go here. Excellent. So there's our key. Let's go through that door. And then we should be going back up top. Grab a few of those coins while I'm at it. And yeah, I did also add some of the donut blocks down below. They appear as bones on this, just in case you fall off those platforms. And there we go. That is the first level I've created with the Prana mod anyway. And yeah, I will have two more coming up very soon, uh, focusing on the other themes of the game. In any case, if you enjoyed this video, I'd love to hear some of your comments down below. Maybe give the video a thumbs up. And yeah, if you are new to the channel, it would be amazing if you could subscribe. Thanks for watching.